Hello lovely people and welcome back to my channel. If you've been following me for a while, you know I've been decluttering my life through five steps. I started with decluttering the rooms, then my hobbies, then my jobs, then my digital spaces, and I'm now at step five, my thoughts. That's not going so well, but I just wanted to look back for a bit and well, I just really miss decluttering the rooms. Since I finished the first round of decluttering my rooms, I just kept on decluttering. A few weeks later, I went through my books and my DVDs again and took out maybe 20 more books. Um, I have done about five more rounds of my clothes and still stuff is going away. There's a giant bag of clothes waiting in the storage space downstairs to go to a secondhand shop as well. Next to that, there are like five boxes as well filled with stuff, with books, with DVDs, with baking equipment, other kitchen stuff, um, some glassware as well, some plates. Um, I just keep decluttering. I can't stop. It's just... I can't stop. I might end up with nothing at all in my house, an empty house. Uh, nah, that's not true. Yeah. I've really been rethinking what I actually need in my life and actually want in my life. In the material way, that is. At the start of the year, we stopped our subscription for the TV. Because we just didn't watch TV. We use Netflix, we use Amazon Prime, and that's basically it. So, we stopped that because it saves us about 10 euros a month and that's always welcome and yeah other than that material stuff I just keep decluttering I keep opening drawers and cabinets and just going through the stuff again and getting rid of stuff again because the first time around so the series room by room I put stuff back that well I was like I like this, maybe I should keep it, it's sentimental, it's something I might need someday. But then the second time around I was like, it's laying around for such a long time already and I haven't touched it in forever. I probably won't touch it in the future either or use it. So why am I still keeping this? It's not needed. So. That turned into a second round, and a third round, and a fourth round. I just keep going back to places that I decluttered before and start decluttering again. I'm really toning it down, so to say, to a more minimalist lifestyle. Because why would you keep all that junk if you don't use it, right? So a lot of it is going to a secondhand store because it's still in a pretty good condition. Um, definitely worth of a second life or a third life, whatever it may be. And yeah, some things went into the trash, but that's very minimal because I'd like to donate it to a secondhand shop rather than just toss it out, especially if it's still good enough for that. But yeah, I just really miss decluttering the rooms. I'm been putting off step five for sure for a long time because it's just hard to dive into your own brain your own thoughts your own mind and explore that and give all the things that happened in your past and re well just give that a place it's gonna be tough I think I'm just gonna uh, set one day a week or something an hour a week to just sit down and write down what's on my mind and work from there but I haven't set the time and the date yet so that still has to happen I'd rather just declutter actual material stuff than declutter the thoughts and memories and all that in my brain which is I think quite understandable but it has to happen too I have to take care of some mental items as well um, just to free up, well, space in my brain, so to say, just to be able to live a happier life, uh, less, um, less full of worries, all that. 
but it's gonna be a long process. I can't do that in a day, like I can declutter a room in a day. But we'll have to work on it. Um, yeah, in the meantime I'll probably just keep decluttering the rooms as well. I just can't stop. It's just too much fun to free up space and to just see the changes and feel so much happier when there is more space and not so much clutter in your house, in your life. It just really helps me personally to be more at ease, more relaxed and be able to have time for other things instead of just worrying about all the stuff that's around that I don't really need. I probably should end this video here because I could rant on forever about how I miss decluttering the rooms, the actual stuff, and that I will keep on doing that for a very long time. And I could almost say, if you want me to help you declutter, just leave a comment. <laughs> um, yeah, that's how addicted I am, I think. I just hope my boyfriend stops me before I actually get rid of everything in the house because that's not really necessary. If you like decluttering too, um, give this a thumbs up. Don't forget to check out the decluttering series playlist. I'll link it below. It will also be in a card up here somewhere. And yeah, subscribe if you haven't already. And then I'll see you in the next one next week. Bye!